Hi everyone, here's how I tell when and how to harvest my broccoli, or broccolini in my case here, so I get multiple harvests from each plant. Now I'm growing broccolini here, which is a little bit more compact than broccoli, and this one here is in its sweet spot. It is prime and ready to harvest. The one right next to it, it's flowered, it's a couple days late, but no problem, it's still gonna be delicious, but for the best flavor, you definitely wanna catch it before it flowers. Now, broccolini is a little more compact than broccoli with nice two to three inch heads. Broccoli, you'll wanna look for four to seven inch heads, but these little teeny tiny florets on top are actually small flowers that haven't opened yet. So you can see here, the florets are nice and tight. You wanna catch it before they open up and start to flower when the head is a nice vibrant green color and the leaves are a nice vibrant green color. Once you start to see a little bit of yellow on the florets and a little bit of yellow on the leaves, it loses a little bit of its flavor. So let's look at the one right next to it here. You can see there's a little bit of yellowing on the bottom of the leaves, which is a sign that it's just getting ready to open up. It's got, already got some flowers on it. The flowers, however, are edible. They're great on salads and the bees absolutely love them. So it will be super tasty, but just not quite at its prime like the one right next to it is. The key to harvesting your broccoli at just the right time is to keep an eye on your plants. So once the heads reach two to three inches for broccolini, four to seven inches for broccoli, or when the weather heats up, because it doesn't like temperatures above 75 or 80 degrees, keep an eye on your plants so you can harvest at just the right time for the best flavor. Now that you know when to harvest broccoli, let's talk about how to harvest broccoli so you get multiple harvests from the same plant. Who doesn't want that? By following this tip, you'll be harvesting broccoli for four to six weeks. Your garden will be working for you. You'll have lots of fresh, tasty veggies on your table. So the key to getting these multiple harvests is don't just harvest the broccoli head, but you wanna harvest about two to three inches of the main stem on broccolini, broccoli about four to six inches. So we're gonna go ahead and clip it down here. And what that does is it sends the plant's energy into producing little side shoots, which will continue to produce that delicious broccoli that we all love. So you can see here on this plant, we already have little teeny tiny side shoots coming out. By harvesting that main broccoli crown, these are gonna grow and develop and you'll be able to harvest more in probably about three to four weeks. This is so pretty, I can't wait to eat this. Let's harvest this one over here. And for this one, we're gonna go down about four to six inches. It's a little bit longer of a stem. I'm gonna clip right here in between these two little broccoli shoots that are already starting to form. Wow, this is so pretty. And what you wanna do is you let these little broccoli shoots grow. They're gonna be smaller than the first broccoli head that we just harvested. When you harvest them, the little shoots, you wanna harvest them just below the next set of leaves and then more shoots will continue to form along the bottom of the broccoli stem. There's already quite a few little broccoli shoots developing here, which is pretty exciting. We've got one, a teeny tiny, tiny one down here at the bottom all over the base of this plant. So we're definitely gonna be harvesting broccoli off this for the next four to six weeks. So make sure you subscribe to me in 2022 for all the updates. Follow me and I'll show you how to grow your own garden grocery store with lots and lots of veggies to eat. It's gonna be so much fun. There's a lot of really simple ways to eat broccoli. We love to stir fry it or pop it into omelets, saute it, throw some lemon and some garlic on top or grill it. It's just so, so tasty. Now we're gonna harvest these right behind me here as well. You might as well while we're here, these are flowering just a little bit more, but we'll top these, uh, put these flowers on some salads. And again, I'm gonna go down here about uh, three or four inches or so. Oh, these are just so pretty. And you can already see lots and lots of little side shoots coming out here. We've got a really nice one and lots of little teeny tiny ones along the stem. We are gonna have a really nice crop of broccoli this year. So oh, pretty. I want to invite you, follow along with me in 2022 to grow your gardens. I'll show you how. And head over to calikimgardenhome.com for all of your seeds and containers. I have 23 seed collections, which are handy seed kits organized by season or type of vegetable, such as spring garden, herb, pea, and lettuce. And when you purchase any of my seed collections, smart pots or books, you'll receive a free lettuce seed collection, which is five different varieties with your purchase. And this sale runs until Wednesday, January 12th, 2022. 
And I do have a new book coming out in March called Raised Bed Gardening. And right now, if you pre-order my book, the link's over at calicumgardenhome.com, you'll receive a $10 gift card. You can take $10 off any receipt collections or smart pots. Thanks so much for following along. Let me know if you're growing or harvesting broccoli in your garden right now. We'll see you on the next video.